came. Why is this no surprise? Because our destinies run together, Raziel, like two rivers that have met and can never be distinct again. At your every fatal turn, you'll find me. And the free will you said was mine. What has become of that? You still have it. And that has everything to do with my presence here now. It was your machinations that set my destiny in motion. The coin you tossed has struck the earth. Now you must abide by its outcome. The coin is still turning, Raziel. To reach the resolution we both can live with, that will best serve our futures, Janos Audren must not be raised. Because you do not wish it. Is my free will to be exercised only when it accords with your whim? There is much more at stake in this than you know. Yes, and it is Janos who has the answers I desire. You must trust me, Raziel. Our intentions for Nosgoth, for our futures, are not so diverse. I must trust you. Or... I have not come here to threaten you, Raziel. You say that while you hold in your hand the instrument of my doom? I saved you from the Reaver once. I have no intention of imprisoning you within the blade. At least not until the moment it serves your plans to do so. You are not the only one at risk. I may carry the instrument of your destruction, but I too have taken a chance in coming here. Or haven't you realized? You bear the only weapon that can kill me. Then you know what I am, and who you are. I believe I do. And still you think you can move me about like your pawn? Think again, Cain. Take heed, Raziel. Why? If we are who we are, then are we not destined to fight to the death to decide the fate of Nosgoth? Don't be a fool! I will not fight you! And that will be the prophesied hero's battle. I win because you will not fight me! The mighty Cain, scion of balance, would-be savior of Nosgoth, surrenders before the final battle even begins! <laughs> If this will make you see reason... Now, you will listen to me. The heart of darkness must remain undiscovered. Great harm will come of its use. You don't know where it is, do you? No. You never looked for it. It doesn't matter, Raziel. Listen to me. You must understand that every creature is bound to one predestined path. We are all shackled. To the wheel of fate. Believe me, I know that even better than you do. All but one. Because of your remaking, you are the one unbound creature. The one among us all that truly has free will. You have a choice, Raziel. Which I'm sure I must make at your direction. Your pawn has reached the end of the board, Cain. And now my powers may even surpass yours. How ironic. If the creature that you made should prove your own undoing. Now, we finish this. Once and for all. Woe 
to the conquered. I have found the heart of darkness, and you go to oblivion. Cain was gone. The madness of this place had somehow fueled my rage. And as it subsided, I felt no elation, no sense of victory. Only a calm certainty that we had once again walked blindly into our enemy's trap. I couldn't be sure whether Cain had truly intended to destroy me. And now it appeared I would never know. In my absence, the estate had been overrun by Mobius' soldiers. I hoped that they had not yet found the entrance to the crypt or discovered the body of Janos. Of Vorador, there was no sign. Raziel, the conquering hero. I understand we ought to offer congratulations. Cain, at last, is dead. I suppose you expect similar congratulations on the death of Vorador. Or has he eluded you? We have him. But not without a considerable price in blood. That will have pleased him. Let it sustain him until his head is off. And every vampire in Nosgoth at last is dead. And will that knowledge sustain you? You too are going to your death. For a true servant of the One God, death is never bitter. I will go. Again at peace with the knowledge that I have played my small part in our master's plans. Cain is at last destroyed, and you have carried out the deed. Which hero do you think you are now? The vampire savior, or the other one? Have you realized yet that it didn't matter to us which one either of you thought you were? so long as the result was the same in the end. And now, Cain is dead. Really, I cannot thank you enough. So, this has all been arranged every step of the way. And Cain thought I truly had free will. Oh, but you do. And there's the greatest triumph of all. To have compelled the one player who could choose into doing exactly what we required. Well done, faithful servant. And now, I have an execution to see to. This relic had come at so high a cost, my blood offering for the answers I sought from this enigmatic corpse. It was the price of my freedom, for which Cain had paid with his life. Had I journeyed so far and forsaken so much, only to have it end like this. I remember. Raziel, the heir of prophecy. You came for the reaver just before the Seraphon found me. You've been entombed here for five centuries. Your murderers are long dead. <gasps> five hundred years? And Vorador? Also dead. Your bloodline is erased. The age of the vampires is coming to an end. Then we must waste no time. I'm not who you think I am. Nor is this a benevolent act. I have questions that apparently you alone can answer. 
Brazil, there are forces in this world that will strive to deceive you and pervert your destiny. But you must believe your arrival foretells the salvation of the vampire race. Why then would the vampires devise a weapon to consume and imprison their savior? No, that cannot be. While the blade yet exists, I am drawn inexorably toward my doom. It was you who bound me to this fate. Only you can release me. Raziel, you have been misled. You are ordained by prophecy to wield the Reaver. <sighs> and so I do, though not quite as you'd envisioned. Redeemer and Destroyer. Is it possible? Did I misread all the signs? It seems your destiny is more labyrinthian than I had imagined. You must trust me, Raziel. We may have very little time. I will convey you to the place where your answers lie. We are within the ancient citadel of the vampire race, long ago defiled and abandoned. This fortress endured through centuries of war against our great enemy. The Hilden? Yes. From this chamber, we witnessed the summoning of the pillars and the banishment of our adversaries from the land. <sighs> this is a dire omen. The binding is in peril. The hour of prophecy is at hand. It's too late. The pillars are already damned. As long as a single one of us stands, there is still hope. The pillars must not remain under human guardianship. They are not competent to serve. Why then did you allow the pillars to fall into human hands? Raziel, there is no time. I want answers. The world can end this instant for all I care. Very well. The Hilden cursed us as they fell, afflicting our race with a predatory bloodthirst. But with this transformation came our enemy's true revenge, immortality. They liberated you from the wheel of fate. They imprisoned our souls in this flesh, expelling us from the purifying cycle of death and rebirth. And yet you pass the curse on. It was a necessary evil. Our immortality banished us from God's grace. He turned his sight from us and fell silent. Many took their own lives, unable to bear the separation from our god. Not you, though. Curse or blessing, it is the price we pay to keep the Hilden banished from the land. To sustain the binding, we had to preserve our bloodline, and so we passed the dark gift to the human successors of our fallen guardians. They rebelled, inevitably, refusing the curse and seizing the pillars as their own. And so we come to our present dilemma. While mankind governs the pillars, the binding decays. The Hilden strain against the barriers of their prison, scratching to gain a foothold back into this world. And what does all this mean to me? We stand at the threshold of a new eon, Raziel and you are the fulcrum upon which our destiny turns. Beneath this room lies our innermost sanctum. The outer chamber has been opened. It appears events are already in motion. This token is the key to the mysteries you seek. I cannot accompany you. You must face this trial alone. If you prevail, you will have your answers. And if I fail the test? Then you will not return.